Hi guys, welcome to my channel. So today I'm going to do a bloom on this 13 inch round that I cut out myself. Um, it's kind of fun to do the whole process, um, like start by cutting out your own round, uh, priming it, then doing your painting, and then resin, and the whole nine yards. It's a lot of fun to just uh, be able to do it completely. And plus you get to use power tools, so uh, fun for everyone. Um, but anyway, so I'm doing this one today for, um, a challenge that I did in our Facebook group, uh, Paint Pouring by Venom Fluid Art. Um, if you haven't checked it out, you should go over there and check it out. It's an amazing group full of amazing artists and people, um, a whole lot of fun and just the best Facebook group there is. So I have the a link in my description so just go click on it and come join our group uh, you'll be glad you did so in that group um, I did a Valentine's challenge and so that's what this is about um, I'm gonna use pinks purples reds um, all those Valentine's love colors you know so that's what I'm working on today um, so I'm going to Go ahead and start putting some colors down. I went ahead and put uh, the pillow paint down, which is it's PPG paint, and it's in an interior satin, and it's like a light pink color. Mix it up, give it a good mixing. Okay, that's a little better. Okay, so we're gonna put that down first, and it's still thick, but. I think maybe I can hopefully manage it. We'll see. I don't want them to mud up at all, so that's kind of why I left it a little thicker. Okay, so there's that. That's the Daxazine Purple. The next color I'm going to put down is this red that um, I don't know. Um, it just said red because it was a gift, but it's really pretty. So let's uh, put that one down. Yeah, and I, if I sound like I'm talking fast, I am, because I don't want this pillow paint to dry. Um, everything seems to be drying up super fast today, and I can't uh, seem to keep up. It's uh, drying before I can get it blowed up and spun out, but I don't know. So, maybe I'm just talking too much. <laughs> Alright, so there's that one. And then I think I'm going to go with, uh, da -da -da, I'm going to go with this Liquitex, and it's medium magenta. A little thick too but I think it'll be okay all right let's do that and... <laughs> all right one more little tweak I guess go out that way a little bit okay and then I'm gonna go with let's go with this one and it's the Akashika or whatever from Eye Candy, and it's the pearlescent color. Super pretty. That's that one. I'm going to go with that one. Alright. Everything's getting a little thick because, um, to be honest, I've done this about three times and I have not had good luck. But my pillow's been messing with me and everything. So, you know, you have the good days and the bad days. I had a good day yesterday, so today is going to be the day that I have issues, obviously. Okay, so let me see. I've got those. So it looks like the only two I have left is the purple and this pink. So I'm going to put the pink down first, I think. And this is a super pretty pearlescent pink, too. And I don't know who makes it either because it was just a gift in the bag. So let's put that down. Right. Okay, and then um, I'm going to put that purple down and we are going to blow this out and see what happens and this purple is the um, uh, da, 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 what is it? <laughs> Ultramarine Violet by, um, by Amsterdam okay so I'm going to put that on there last looks like that's the end of that one it worked out because it was just enough Okay, um, my cell activators, I'm going to use two. Um, the first one is um, 
Prussian blue, and I found this quite a while ago. Or, I'm sorry, I just found it, but it was made up quite a while ago, like about a year and a half ago, to be honest. So, I just found it, and I know it's got to have some Australian Floetrol in there because that's what I was using at the time. So, um, all I did was add a splash of water, and I added um, just a splash of American Floetrol to try to try to kickstart it again. So, um, so hopefully it'll be okay. And I did um, the same with the white, but I don't think I'm going to use the white. I'm just going to use the Prussian blue and I've got a purple that is the dioxazine purple and that is mixed with two parts water to one part American Floetrol to one part paint, which is my cell activator that I use all the time um, because right now I just can't afford the, uh, the Australian Floetrol to be honest, but um, it works. So that's what I'm using, these two cell activators. And then um, I'm going to add just a little splash of water to that because it's gotten really dry. Oh, I won't do too much. Okay. And this is, um, like I said, this one is the, um, is the dioxazine purple. And I love that color, actually. So purple is my thing. If you know me, you know that well. So we're going to do that with that. Okay. I'm just going to put some of that on there here. Okay. There's that. We're going to blow this out. Light me up. Don't you stop. Cause tonight it's on the line. Show me how you get on down. Close my eyes. Take me for a ride. have goobers on my channel okay I think that's pretty good all right so here she is uh, tell me what you think in the comments uh, please like share and subscribe I appreciate all of you who have done that already you guys know I love you to death 
Um, I hope you guys have a great day or great night. Um, if you have any questions, of course, you know, leave them in the comments. Um, I'll get back with you as soon as, I, as possible. And you guys know I love to hear your feedback. So leave me a message. Let me know what you think of it. Um, I'm always, I'm always good to hear what you think. Um, I love hearing from you. So leave me a message or ask me a question and I would be happy to answer or reply back. So, all right, guys, have a great day or night and I will see you on the next one. Love you guys. Bye.